Retro Rob plays everything. Hello there gamers, Retro Rob here, and if you have an X18, there's probably a good chance that you have thrown it into a nasty little boot loop, especially if you've been trying to put Google Play services on it. I've done that several times. So I'm gonna show you how to put this thing into safe mode so you can get back into your OS. Now, I'm gonna note that I'm not stuck in a boot loop right now. I had a hard time making a boot loop, which usually I can do accidentally all the freaking time. But anyway, the process goes pretty much the same. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit the on button and I'm gonna wait for the POW Kitty logo to show up. I said I'm gonna hit the power button there we go, and wait for that Pow Kitty logo to come up. Now I'm gonna start spamming the minus button. So this is the volume down button, and I'm just gonna spam it a bit. Really, if I knew the exact timing, I could pretty much do this without spamming it. I could just hit it at the right time, but I'm not 100% sure of the timing. Note that if you're caught like in a reboot loop, like you're just going through it, you can probably hold this down because it tends to get right in the right spot anyway. But, here we go. Having lots of fun. And here we are in safe mode. You can see down in the bottom it says safe mode. And basically what it does is it loads a minimal version of the operating system. So uh, what you can do now that you're in here, I'm gonna assume that it's your Google Play services that's doing it. So basically you go in here, go into apps, and then uh, where's my faulty Google Play services? There they are right there. And I'm just gonna force stop. Don't really have to do that part, but I do. And then I'm gonna uninstall them. And then when I reboot, I'll go back to normal mode. One thing to note is that when you reboot, it will go back to the default menu, so you'll need to set that back up. I mean, it won't completely delete your old menu, but it will set you to the, to the uh, original menu, and then you'll just have to set it back. All right, that's it. It was pretty much that easy. That's uh, how you get yourself out of a boot loop. I wanna thank you very much for watching this video. And if you enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe for more. I'll see you in a couple days. Bye.